वन अगेन वेलकम बैक टू सेवन इंजीनियर यूट्यूब चैनल इन दिस शॉर्ट प्रैक्टिकल वीडियो आई विल गाइड यू फॉर डिजाइन ऑफ स्टील रेन फोर्समेंट इन द कंस्ट्रक्शन ऑफ दिस आर सी सी स्लेब विच इज डिजाइन फॉर फाइव स्टोरी कमर्शियल बिल्डिंग लेट मी गाइड यू फॉर सम इम्पॉर्टेंट टेक्निकल टर्म्स इन द कंस्ट्रक्शन ऑफ दिस आर सी सी स्लेब लेट्स गेट स्टार्ट गाइज इफ यू सी गाइज दिस इज आर सी सी कॉलम साइज इज फिफ्टीन बाय फिफ्टीन इंचज With 12 number of steel rods, dia is 16 millimeter, which is designed for five-story commercial building. They will use here M20 grade concrete, which ratio is one ratio 1.5 ratio three. You can see, guys, we have 12 steel rods, dia is 16 millimeter. This is 60 grade steel rods. You can see clearly, guys, the span between these two column is here 28 feet. Now let me guide you for size of beam, which is twelve by eighteen inches with concrete cover. You can see, guys, they placed sanitary pipes inside this beam, which can weak the strength of this beam. It should not be provided. Next, guys, you can see main bars are placed at the bottom of this slab, which dia is twelve millimeter. On the top of this, they placed distribution bar, which transfer the load to the main bars and main bars. distribute the load to the beams and beams transfer to the columns and columns to the footing on the other side guys you can see they provided extra steel rods to resist negative bending moment as i discussed in many videos that at the end of the beam or at the distance of l by 4 where we have negative bending moment to resist negative bending moment extra bars bars should be provided which is not economical but on the other side we have crank bar or bent up bar which is economical both of them you can use but which is looking good to you that's up to you next guys you can see clearly extra steel rod is uh, uh, not economical but i am not recommending you uh, especially for those people which are making uh, the construction of residential building because uh, the residential building budget is low compared to the high resident uh, the commercial building on the other side guys you can see they provided concrete cover which is 20 mm or 1 inch guys you can see on both directions at the distance of l by 4 on the other side guys we have four bars at the bottom and three at the top to our side bars in this floor beam spacing of stirrups you can see which are placed at the distance of 5 inches and the distribution sorry the uh, you can see here the stirrup dia is 10 mm and the longitudinal bars which are already provided inside this beam which is 16 mm and hooks are bent on 135 degree which is looking good to you and also i think uh, this is the uh, from the is 456 2000 which is very important to provide uh, the bent up uh, the bent or hooks at the distance of or at the angle of 135 degree guys you can see the extra steel rods is separated mesh on the top of the singly mesh guys you can see now here at the distance of l by 4 this is doubly mesh to resist negative bending moment on both directions in one way slab we are providing in one side and two way slab we are providing on both directions because there we have negative bending moment on both directions you can see guys the dia is 12 mm for main bars and distribution bars spacing is 6 by 6 inches you can see clearly Before starting steel reinforcement, guys, you can see they provided polythene sheet, or you can provide the plastic because during segregation or bleeding, it can protect from the bleeding, especially the concrete, because that is the main important water, especially, or this is the blood of the concrete. You can see, guys, the spacing is five inches at the distance of L by four extra steel rods. You can see, guys. This span is twenty-eight feet. On the other side, you can see which is about thirty feet. This is a long span. We have two spans here. One is longer span, the other one is shorter span. But the span is long, so therefore, the extra steel rod should be provided at the distance of L by three. What is L by three? The span between two columns should be divided by three. That is the place to resist negative bending moment. So we are providing extra steel rods. So this is a short video in which I guided you for steel reinforcement details in the construction of this RCC slab. Thanks for watching. See you in next video. Goodbye.